please help me. I just been assaulted. Oh my God, what, what's wrong, ma'am? What happened? I was minding my business in a world where black women can't even do that. And a black man asked me for my number. And when I told him no, his anger came up and he hit me with a brick aggressively. He didn't cut the skin or break no bones, but he hit me, man. Oh my God, here, take everything in my pocket. Hold on, here, I got some more. Uh, my pockets are extra deep for people like you who are real victims of senseless violence. Here you go. Is that enough? Yeah, yeah. This is gonna get a BBL. This is like sixty grand. Uh, oh, y yes. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. Hey, hold on, y'all. Something fishy about this. She got hit with a brick aggressively, and she ain't got no gashes, broken bones, or blunt force trauma. And then she got a history of domestic violence and scamming. Let's look into this just a little bit more. I'll just say you fucking hate black women and get it over with. I'm just trying to help. We don't need your fucking help. Shit. Now, miss, are you good? Damn, wait, where'd she go? Oh, yeah, Houston Police Department. We're actually here to question you about the lady that you donated money to because we're looking for her for fraud. What you mean, fraud? She really got assaulted, right? Well, kinda. She was arguing with a guy friend of hers where she then assaulted him first, and he assaulted her back. And in Texas, we call that a self-defense fight. Wait, so she wasn't an innocent black woman minding her business victim of a black man's fragile ego and inability to take rejection? Because I really want to believe that. And did she not get hit with a brick aggressively? No, ma'am. She just worded that story like that and pushed that narrative because she knew that would be the one to go viral and pull at the emotions of enough people to get them all to dig deeper into their pockets to make the GoFundMe more profitable. She just played off of the emotions of people. Well, I still believe her. And we still looking for her. So if you find her, call Houston PD. Hey, before you go, can you apologize to the black men who actually do support black women but still got crucified for going against the narrative? Never!